Hey. He seems unhappy talking to me. Okay, so today... I'll admit, I didn't think you'd make it this far. I can tell you're different than the usual invaders, so I'll not bother with the usual tricks and illusions I use to scare off the superstitious. Good. When the bombs fell, everything changed. We changed. And somehow, I received a gift. Actual magic. The stuff of Not legend. Grim locale. Perhaps you'd like to see some. Do it. Up. Uh. No matter what you do, I can heal my friends, and we will protect what is ours. Oh, you're... Okay. You're attacking me. Listen. No. Do 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 up. Ah. Hi. Listen, I have a sword too. Okay, fine. Really? Okay, running. What else you got? So long. Ha. Soon got me good. If I do give him another crit, he's gonna die. Wait, he... Oh. Sorry, but I'm not going out that easily. The show must go on! His little work to well, res... The guy didn't work. your asinine assault won't be dissuaded. Then I guess it's time for our final act. I have no idea what's Join going the on, Nick. Join the roof of King Cola's castle, and we'll see an end to this production. Oh, all right then. I guess we'll do that then. Okay. I believe this is the roof. You raiders are all the same. You come into someone's home, steal their belongings, and kill those they care about. I'm not going to let you kill any more of my friends. This is our home, not yours. I'm not your enemy. This can end without bloodshed. We've defended be friends. this place for over 200 years. Do you think you're the first outsider I've met that's chosen to brand feral ghouls as monsters? How many of them have you needlessly slaughtered while ignorantly thinking you're doing the world a favor? Ghouls like your friends. It's too late for them. The radiation changed them forever. So you're admitting my friends are sick and yet you try to kill them anyway? I'd say that makes you the only monster around here. It's not a sickness. The radiation has consumed their minds. They've, they've become feral. You're wrong. Rachel is going to find a way to cure them. We're going to fix this. 
My beloved left this place years ago to find a cure to this disease. In return, I swore that I'd keep our people safe by defending our home. Now you're the last. When Rachel walks back through those gates left. with the cure in hand, then you'll see, everyone will see, that I was right. If there is a cure, the only way she'll find it is with your help. Maybe you're right. If Rachel is still out there, I'll find her. And we'll search for this cure together. I'll gather what remains of my friends. And we'll leave this place in your care. Don't worry about the radiation. It will no longer be a burden to you and your kind. Here, you should have this. Consider it an apology for misjudging you. Whoa. Well, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Farewell. I have no idea what the F just happened. We're sucking down a lot of rad sticking around here. But I convinced him to leave, so... That's good. Although I wonder if I can actually find the, uh... Find him. Been about 50 years since the bombs fell. Some large groups come and go. Usually, they've managed to scare them off or use the radiation sprays to get rid of them. Seems like most of the attackers are just terrified of the clown makeup. It's kind of sad. They used to bring people so much laughter. On the whole, things are good. We have plenty of food, wire, and partial power when we need it. As I'd imagine, it's a lot more than most others have. I mean, the mutation from the radiation storms hasn't been that bad after we learned to cope with it. I'm glad Rachel is still alive. I think she's the only thing keeping me together. Can't sleep. We've had to board up another person today. That's over a ten in the past year alone. I'm trying to keep everyone organized and keep everyone's spirits up since Kenneth Mitchell and Herman are gone. But there are some days I just don't want to even get out of bed. Some of them started talking about putting the afflicted out of their misery, but we put a stop to that talk pretty fast. We've been here a long time, and now these aren't just the people I survived the war with. They're in my new family. We have to find a way to help them. There was a big attack that Dean got hit by a stray bullet. Thought of losing another. Uh, Another of us caused me to snap, and suddenly it was as though energy was literally flowing from my body. And they just shot up and gasped for air. I healed them, but I have no idea how. After the attack, it hit me. Was this some sort of mutation, or was it real magic? I mean, from the circumstances, you could tell the difference. Even if we had a scientific explanation, does that really make it less magical? Regardless of what I want to call it, maybe I can use my powers to help the afflicted. Some big gang took the group took out that group in Nuka Town this week. The gang looks pretty aggressive, so we've decided to leave them be for now. It's too bad we've almost decided to make contact with the traitors there. Now, now it looks like looks like we missed our chance. Rich was talking about one or both of us breaking from the group to try and find a cure somewhere else. But if two of us leave, I don't know if there will be enough leadership to keep this place together. It's been over a year since little Rachel left and still no word. At home there's nobody left, no one but me and the afflicted and that gang of raiders next door. At first I was wishing that Rachel had stayed behind, but I kept coming to the conclusion that she did the right thing. No matter how much it hurt, she had to leave for the good of us all. The only problem is that I don't know how much longer I can hold the castle. The walls are crumbling, the walls are... Oh, the walls are crumbling, the walls are crumbling, and I don't know how much longer I can hold them up. I miss you, Rachel. Ah. He's a nice guy. Oh, no. Oh, he can do that from this terminal? That's... That's why he just did it so quickly. Can't open it from this end. You can't open it from this end. Which is me. Well... <laughs> uh. Huh. Wow. This place is big. This place is big. All oh, right. Yeah, they want me to do that. But 
I'm thinking no. Okay. So I'm a asshole to some place. How about no? I don't care. I don't need that. Sign a gang. Sign a gang. Sign a gang. Sign a gang. I just need to do the bottling plant, right? Is that the last one? Or is that all of them? I think that's basically it. Just. Oh, that might actually be it. Weird. Okay. Well, I guess that means it's time that I actually killed raiders. They're all secure. Yep, that's it. That's 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 all it. Okay. Well, All right then. It is time to destroy. Time to destroy the raiders. And, uh, yeah. That's what it's time to do. All right. So, here is my plan. I think the best thing I can do is try to take out the, uh... You all considered putting the bullet in Coulter's back at some point. Uh... I suppose you just beat us to it. Who am I taking out first? Wasn't them. Bullet cars... The pack lets it all hang out. Good for you, that's gross. Standing out, you ain't worth looking at. That's... Gross. Anyway, um, no, that wasn't it. It was the place under my house. That's what I was gonna do. Oh, hi there. If you're wearing a collar, it's because you asked for it. Ain't no one's a slave. That was a pack. That's right. My plan is to kill the uh. Sharing this park with pack animals. These guys, the disciples. At least we don't hide behind masks. Mags, William, and Lizzie. Like that, you really All you have to do is hear them speak to know they weren't born into this. Yeah. And that's basically because they're in a dark place and I think I can probably get them or easier ish. I think, probably. And they're also probably very dangerous. Not probably, they are very dangerous and I need to stop walking into things like an idiot. Alright, so. New quest? Open season. That okay. last one died too fast. I'm losing my touch. I think I can probably do Sandman kills on a lot of people too, which will make me my stuff easier. My stuff. It'll make my stuff easier. Yeah. What is? What is this? Talks to them all quiet for a few minutes. Then these four saps march. I had it out with that disciple chick again today. Anna. Tired of her always winning. She's got better aim, better comebacks, even packs a better punch. Well, not for long. Fuck these rules. I'm going after her. Then, when she's floating face down in the swamp pond, we'll see who's better. I can't wait to see. What the hell? How'd you hit him, you? What? A girl's got her ways. I'm just here because Anna's big into helping Nisha keep the peace between all us gang. Me? Not so much. What the hell? That should keep you quiet till I get you back to Fizz Top. Oh, were you recording this just for little old me? You operators are such sweethearts. Oh, that's what this is. Hey, Ruth, Sammy just came back with this girl Dixie, and 
brought the best news ever. She said she comes from a place where we'll be safe and protected, called Nuka World. Finally. I am so tired of trying to live out here on our own, dealing with raiders and finding food and just surviving. We're packing up to leave, and we're out of here. I wanted to leave this message for you. It's awfully sweet of y'all to welcome a stranger into your home. You've no idea how happy we are that we ran into you. Not as happy as I am. What are you doing? Wait, I thought you were here to... Kate! Run! I am not happy. Pam, no! What have you done? Oh, don't worry, honey. I'll never keep two lovebirds apart. No! No! What's this? I think I'll keep you as my little souvenir. Trading this area seems pretty scarce. I'm thinking of packing it in and heading back to the Commonwealth. I lost one of the Brahmins to some damn rad scorp the other day. And I think Emmy's coming down with something. The rest of us are just at each other's throats. Tired of traveling and barely running into any business. This whole plan was a bust. As it is, we barely got enough to pay for our losses. Hey, are all y'all traders? If so, I know a pretty good post nearby. Guarantee you'll turn a profit if you want to check it out. Yeah, well, I'm not sure we want to trust anything some stranger in a mask told us. You sure you're not some sort of raider? I ain't no raider. And I only wear this mask on account of some Yao Gua wanting a piece of me a while back. It's up to you folks. If y'all are interested, Nuka World's just a short trip north. Can't miss it. Just tell them Dixie sent you, and they'll treat you and yours like y'all are family. Hmm. We'll talk about it. Thanks for stopping by. Maybe we'll have to check out this Nuka World outpost before heading back. It'd be worth a shot. I'll have to talk with the others. I hope no fights break out this time. Swear to God, I'll kill them all. I think I know what I have to do. I'm certain I know exactly what it is I have to do. Do you go to sleep at any point in time? Because that's what I'm waiting for. Oh, she has a terminal. This this is, can only bring bring good things. This can only this can only bring happiness to me. Yes. Rumors are saying Ruby's stealing from her own. Not sure. It pissed me off more that she's stealing from us or that she got caught. Either way, I don't have any proof besides Paige's claim, and Paige is probably too high on Jet to trust. I'm going to let it sit. So, if I find remains of what looks like Josie's handiwork of Winter Hill people. Why is it so damn hard to follow? When you hide a body, not only do you sure you make it hidden, you make sure it's really dead. As the boy said, the pack I was halfway back to Nukatana when he found him. No saw proof it was Josie besides the fact that she just that she and this guy got into it the other day. Sam seems to forget who's in charge here and likes to question my decisions. He's smart enough to not challenge me directly, and I'm sure he knows if he tried to take me out, Savoy and Dixie would never follow him. He's trouble though. Reminds me of Sledge. And he's new, so he doesn't know what went back, uh, went, uh, went down back then. But if he keeps it up, he can learn the hard way, just like Sledge did. I think I fought Sledge. On what's for a different reason, Carrie is a bit of a conscience, stops going on raids, barely leaves Fizz top, something's up with her. She's either realized this isn't the life for her, or she's been compromised. 
If I ever find out she's turned traitor, I'm gonna enjoy every moment I have tearing her apart. Ooh. Cook reports. Oh, uh, called Brabrin should be good for a standard supplies for nothing of real interest. They also had some crazies calling themselves Habalas taking taken over old cafe by the giant fire hydrant. Gadmen have inclined to leave him be. Fanatics are always destructive in their own ways. They could be good entertainment from a distance. Fanatics. You are fanatics. Found an old roadside attraction called Grandchester Minster. Ha! <laughs> ha! I know what this is supposed to be. Winchester Mystery Mansion. She said it looks to be a decent condition, complete with an annoying ticket taking protectron, so it's worth looking into. She said a few slaves in tow, so we didn't investigate further. Okay. Nick, from all the way downtown, is aware when I'm hacking terminals. All the way up here. This is... This is just awful. You got grenades. I need to find a place to sit down and uh, wait. Because it's currently, what is the time in world? It's hard to tell. Uh, how do I tell what time it is? There should be an easy way to do that. If I'm not dumb. No. Oh, here we go. 10 a.m. Great! That's just great. The I best thing about wearing a mask? Not having to look like I care when people talk to me. Okay. okay, so Nick and I are gonna leave this place and then when it's nightfall I'll come back because everyone will be asleep. That's what's gonna happen.